Hello everyone in this lecture today I'm going to talk to you about drug doses calculations I'm gonna give you four different examples uh, uh, showing the drug doses calculations drug doses calculations are required when the amount of medication ordered or desired is different from what is available on hand for the nurse or the doctor to administer okay so what is the formula the formula is amount desired D divided by amount on hand times quantity Q and that will give us the number of tablets or capsule required right so which is Y so when the medication is given in tablets the quantity is equals to 1 okay so when the medication is given in tablets the quantity is equals to 1 since the amount of medication available is specified per tablet or one tablet so this is the formula that you should remember amount desired D divided by amount in hand H times quantity Q that gives us the number okay so here is an example question the question says toprolol toprol XL 50 mzpo is ordered toprol XL is available as 100 mz per tablets how many tablets were, were the nurse administer okay so this is the question guys so in this question what is the amount desired amount desired or simply D is equals to uh, this is amount desired or amount ordered that is 50 mz okay so this is 50 mz right 50 milligram and troprol XL is available as 100 mz so that is amount on hand is equals to 100 mz okay so this is 100 milligram and this is per tablet okay so 100 mz is available per tablet so per means one therefore quantity Q equals to one right so then how many tablets would nurse would the nurse administer side right so the number of tablets so okay number of tablets number of tablets this will be equal to amount desired divided by amount on hand times quantity Q so amount desired is 50 mz so it's 50 mz divided by amount on hand is 100 mz right and this times Q is 1 so this MZ MZ it goes away so 50 times 100 which is 1 by 2 that means 0 0.5 tablets so therefore the nurse is going to administer half of the tablet to get this 50 MZ okay desired dose alright so let's move on to next example guys next example question is 1.2 gram of etinol is ordered this medication is only available as 600 mz per tablet how many tablet should the nurse give right so this is the question so here the amount desired or amount ordered okay amount desired or amount ordered that is d which is actually 1.2 gram so whenever you see gram so basically for the amount desired and amount on hand the unit should be same so we, therefore we will convert gram into milligram so 1.2 gram which is equals to 1.2 times 1000 okay 1000 so it will be mz milligram which is actually 1200 okay milligram this is 1200 milligram this is D so we have to convert here guys because um, amount on hand H equals to 600 600 mz okay this amount on hand H equals to 600 mz you see this is an mz this is in gram therefore we converted it into mz we could have also converted it into grams but it's good it's bad I mean we can do any one of these things but you simply convert it into milligram okay so from gram to milligram right so we have here amount desired we have here amount on hand and now next thing we need is the quantity Q it says 600 mz per tablet okay so per tablet that means quantity Q is equals to one that is one tablet so how many tablets should uh, the nurse give so that means the number of tablets number of tablets okay the number of tablets that will be equals to amount desired divided by amount on hand times quantity Q so the amount desired is 1200 mz right and amount on hand is 600 mz milligram times quantity q is 1 so mz mz it goes away 600 
times 2 is 1200. So the number of tablet the nurse should give is 2, 2. Okay, the, therefore the answer is 2 tablets. Alright, so let's move on to next example of drug doses calculation. So it is a little bit different guys. Okay, so the question is dil dilantin 125 is available as 125 mg per ml. Dilantin uh, 0.3 gram uh, PO is ordered. How much should the nurse administer to the patient? Okay, so amount desired or amount ordered is how much? This is 0 0.3 gram. Like I told you, whenever we see in grams, so let's just we just have to convert it into milligrams. So then what we do, we just multiply 0 0.3 times 1000 because 1 gram equals to 1000 milligram. So this will give us 300, 300 milligram. Okay, this is 300 milligram. And so next thing, this is amount desired. And so what is amount on hand, guys? So this is amount desired, amount on hand. Dilantin 125 is available as 125 mg. So amount on hand is 125 milligram, right? So this is 125 milligram. And the next thing is quantity Q. Quantity Q is 5 ml, right? So the quantity Q is 5 ml. So this is 5 ml milliliter so now the question is how much should the nurse administer right so then the amount the nurse should administer that will be equals to uh, the amount desired divided by amount on hand times quantity Q right so then what is amount desired amount desired is 300 mz so this is 300 mz and will be divided by amount on hand which is 125 mz 125 mz and this will be multiplied by quantity q is 5 ml so 5 ml so why the quantity q is 5 ml because this 125 mz is per 5 ml okay so per 5 ml therefore the q is 5 ml okay just remember this per tablet if it is per tablet so then it will be 1 but it is per 5 ml therefore it's for q is equals to 5 ml so now 5 125 so it's it will be 25 and so when um, we divide 300 uh, will when it is divided by 25 uh, okay will be equals to 25 times 4 is 100 and for 312 so 12 ml okay so this the, the 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 amount the nurse should administer is 12 ml okay just the you need to divide this 300 by 25 when you when you do that the the number comes 12 right i hope i'm correct here so yeah so this is done so now the next example guys the next example is furosemide is available as 40 mz in 1 ml 10 mg is ordered to be administered through IV. What amount of fu furosemide should the nurse administer? This is the question. So first we have to find out what is the amount desired or amount ordered. Okay, amount desired or amount ordered is available. This D 10 mg is ordered. Okay, so this is 10 mg. So therefore amount desired or amount ordered. This is equals to 10 mg milligram. And the next thing is um, furosemide is available as 40 mz in 1 ml. So amount on hand is 40 mz. Okay, this is 40 mz. And quantity Q is actually 1 ml. Okay, quantity Q is 1 ml because this 40 mz is available in 1 ml per ml. Okay, so then amount administered. Okay, so the amount administered will be equal to amount desired divided by amount on hand times quantity Q. So the amount desired is 10, which will be divided by 40 times 1 ml. So this will be equal to this 0, 0, this cancels out. And so that means uh, 4, when 1 is divided by 4, the, the, the answer, when 1 is divided by 4, okay, 1 divided by 4, it will be 0 
0.25 ml okay so the amount the nurse should administer is 0 0.25 ml I hope I made the right calculation here you just need to divide 1 by 4 okay use your calculator please all right guys so these are the few examples of dr drug doses calculations I hope this video was helpful thank you very much for your kind attention